goodness. Hi guys. <laughs> Let me put a different setup together. Whoopsie. Whoopsie daisy. Just thoroughly scared the dog. All right. It's Thursday. Uh, the 20... 5th of September 2014, and this is going to be my week 87 post-op lab band update along with my week 26 pregnancy update. I am two days late again, uh, so what? Today marks a week of me being sick. I sound better. Um, <clears throat> thank God I was actually starting to finally feel better. But thankfully it wasn't anything too serious. Uh, sorry. Um... I'll talk about the scales and then talk about my sickness. This week the scale was up a pound, so 20, 21 pounds gain total. And I am okay with that. And I will talk about this in a second. Uh, this week the baby is um, 14 inches. This is the length of a hot house, cu uh, hot house cucumber. I've heard it described as a scallion and an eggplant this week. Whatever. Uh, the baby is 1.75 pounds, according to the sap. What to expect is about two pounds. Whatever. Um, so that is that. I got my baby and we are growing and everything is good with the baby. Um, I don't know if I told you guys I got my lab results back from my gestational diabetes and anemia. Everything is perfect. No anemia, no GD. I am healthy and so is baby. Um, so today marks the week of me being sick. Last Thursday I thought I had really bad heartburn in my chest uh, during work. I was like, whatever, it's heartburn, no big deal. Um, I then came home and later that night and moved up to my throat and my ears started hurting and my throat hurt. And so since then I've been dealing with that. Then Friday, my ears started to hurt. Sorry guys. My ears started to hurt. So then I called my OB to see what I could take for a head cold. They suggested I go ahead and go into urgent care because it was pretty late in the evening when I called. And just to make sure I didn't have an ear infection or anything. Went and saw them. No infection. No nothing going on. So I'll be getting the bill for it. Doing, saying you are fine. <laughs> You're pregnant. You can't take anything. <laughs> so yeah. Um, she did give me numbing ear drops for like children's ear infections. Um, if anything, it made the in my ear feels like it feels like I can't hear anything. So I might be talking really loud. But at the same time, everything's really loud. It's that weird ear thing. Um, and there's a constant ringing in my ear since Friday. So I'm kind of worried that the ringing might be a permanent thing. Um, but there's ringing in my ear. Whenever I put the drops in there, it just amplifies like I have water on top of the ringing. It just wasn't a good deal. Um, they suggested extra rest just because my body has to work through whatever I'm going through. So I've been trying to do that. Um, I have since every day forgot to call my doctor to see if I could take Sudafed or anything. I figure I'm on the mend now, why not? Uh, I was bad and took nasal spray, but I hate breathing through my mouth. <laughs> so I was taking nasal spray as well as emergency vitamin C chewies and Tylenol to help. Tylenol didn't do anything though. At least I don't think so. Um, my throat is better, I'm not as scratchy. Right now I just get really dry mouth and dry throat. Um, still have some drainage going on and the ringing in the one ear, the other ear is fine. So whatever. Um, I mentioned I gained a pound this week and I'm okay with that. I have decided that the scale is just the scale. It's a number. I still look, at least in my opinion, okay. Uh, some days I look even good. Um, I feel fine. I'm able to walk around and do things I need to do still. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of coming to peace with the scale. Um, some days are easier than others still, but my weight fluctuates so much in a week, guys. If I don't take a good poop, that scale's going up. Take a good poop, sometimes that scale can go down four or five pounds. Um, so it is what it is. I'm trying to accept it and just, it's okay. I will live and learn, and I will lose the weight again after this baby is here. Um, and I've just been thinking that this past few weeks, and... There is another pregnant uh, bypass lady, Jennifer. Um, 
I want to say WMD or WMB. I can't remember the last three letters. She is due around me. Um, she's had issues with holding on to a pregnancy. Uh, she's had major surgery to hold on to this pregnancy. She started having contractions and thankfully things were able to stop, but she's only 26 weeks. Yes, it is past the um, viable point for a baby. However, the longer the baby can stay, the better. Um, and you know, that kind of puts in perspective. So what if I gain 30 pounds, 40 pounds? My baby will be here. My baby will be healthy. It could be so much worse than putting on extra weight. Um, so that kind of puts it into perspective. I have another pregnant woman, uh, Brooke. Hi, Brooke. Um, she's on res full restrictions pretty much right now. And um, I don't know if her issues are pregnancy related or not, but she is pregnant and doing around the same time as well. And so I just realized that, you know, it could be worse. And I've been very blessed and very lucky in this pregnancy. Um, I had probably two things of morning sickness. Um, and even then one of those I think was band related. Um, I am doing fine. The doctors aren't worried. All my lab results have been normal. All my ultrasounds have been normal. Um, I get to see my baby again in a week. So, I mean, I am very blessed with this pregnancy and very lucky. So the weight is just that. It's a number. It's a scale. And it is what it is. Uh, so, yeah. But Jennifer, I am thinking of you. Brooke, I am thinking of you. Um, I don't have my waist measurements yet because Keith and I forgot. So I will be getting those in for this month. And we'll see how much it has changed. Um, <sighs> so, yeah, other than that, just tired. I started school on Monday. Um, holy shit, biology, no joke. Um, so after this, I will be eating some lunch so I can take my vitamins. And then I'll be off doing errands and getting things ready. Um, what else is exciting? Nothing much to this, not much this week. Um, the next week will be very exciting. Uh, this weekend is my sister's baby shower, and I wish I was home in Texas, but I can't be. Um, due to a uh, financial situation, uh, yeah. Um, but Olivia, if you watch this, I wish I was there with you. Wish I could be there with you. Wish I could celebrate this time with you. And that's all I'm going to say about that now. Um, but come the next weekend is my baby shower. And I cannot wait. I am so excited to have all my friends together, my family, my stepmom's coming to town and she comes in Thursday and I am so excited and we're going to go ride the duck in Seattle on Friday and I've done it two times already and I can't wait to do it again. Um, so far each tour has been different and it's been a lot of fun. Um, just doing some touristy things with her baby shower on Saturday and then she goes back home Sunday. Um, so yeah, that is pretty much my agenda for the next few weeks. Um, after the baby shower, it is my birthday and I cannot wait. Uh, well, I mean, I can't wait. Yeah, I'll be old. <laughs> um, but yeah, that is pretty much what's going on in my life, guys. Just trying to get the groove of school, schoolwork, and pregnancy, and working, and getting all this together. Um, told you guys I am switching practices. Got that set up, so that's coming up pretty soon. Um, so yeah, in about a month, I will be at a new practice with a new doctor or midwife. So yeah. All right, I will give you guys a 26 weeks belly shot. Um, my hips, if, in case you're wondering, are doing better. I do wear my maternity belt every day, and I just, just got a text saying I left it at work, which is fine because that's mostly where I wear it, and so I'll just go without it. School today. Here with my belly bump. There is my baby. I feel like it's moving up higher and higher, and it's kicking me more and more up here. So I think I don't think my uterus is all the way, up, but it's trying there. It is kicking like crazy now and then um fun fact baby loves biology class uh the two classes i've had so far baby is like just kicking the whole time in there so hopefully i have a baby genius on the way because <laughs> that would hopefully you know get a full tuition ride yeah all right guys i will see you guys next week hope you have a great day bye